One of the amazing things about the world today, one of the most dangerous things about the world today, one of the things which should disturb us the most and concerning which we should be devoting the most attention uh, is what is happening in the world of money. I think you know what happened in India. Uh, must have been maybe two months ago. The Indian Prime Minister addressed the nation on a Sunday morning. I may be wrong by a few hours. And he announced that the two largest currency notes in India, you know, paper money, I think it's the 1,000 rupee note and the 500 rupee note. Uh, from midnight would be demonetized. This is not something which affects Muslims alone. It affects Hindus, it affects Christians. So from midnight, the 1,000 rupee note and the 500 rupee note are going to be demonetized. You can't use them anymore as money. You can't buy and sell with them, no. They have no value except to return them to a bank or to a particular office, which will then accept them provided that you can provide proof that you paid your taxes, that this is uh, halal money, this is good money, not bad money, and so on. And uh, some people are going to have difficulties and they're going to end up with paper money in their hands that they can only use as wallpaper. That's right. If you cannot provide the proof needed for your money to be accepted, it's no longer money. That's all. Did you pay your taxes on this money? So on. If the money is accepted, then it may be changed for smaller notes. I'm not too sure about that. Otherwise, it's credited to a bank account. So every, every individual who is using money must have a bank account. And once you have a bank account, the money will be credited to your account. The reason why the Indian government did that and created havoc in India, enormous difficulties for the Indian, innocent Indian people, Hindus, Muslims, Christians, it didn't matter. Was according to the Prime Minister, uh, he said, we, we are after the people who are uh, in the black, black money. Black money? Is money black and white as well? Oh my gosh, I wish we had Malcolm X here to take that and throw it in the garbage. I mean, how can you use the term black money? What's wrong with black color? Huh? Well, the money that is illegal according to them. And uh, that's why you demonetize this. this. Is this the best way? Or is this the most stupid way possible for dealing with money which is illegally held? Hmm? Then subs subsequently, the Indian Prime Minister spoke more honestly. And he admitted that the reason why we have done this is because we want everybody to enter into the electronic money system. Oh, I see. So this is what Wall Street did. And they use India as a guinea pig to test, to test what is to come tomorrow. So in the same way that you could look up at the sky and say there's rain coming, so too we in this program are telling you this is a sign of what India did. This is a sign of what is coming tomorrow.